Hi everyone, welcome to another 5 minute chess game. I am playing a 2308. Hmm. He's playing an opening I'm not super familiar with, so I'm just gonna play kind of hedgehog style, I suppose. Hope this is okay. So it looks like a Kali right now. He's gonna go e4 maybe. Alright, I'm gonna take this. And I'm just playing kind of like a, um, a Tory, but with black. I mean, it's kind of just a solid setup, hedgehog-like. I want to get my queen to a8 sometimes, you know. Rook c8, rook c7 makes a lot of sense. Rook e8 makes sense always. I'm just going to do it right now. Um, I didn't have to do it right away, but it just, things want to go to f8, like a knight or a bishop. I, I don't know which one, but... It helps to solidify my position a little bit. Anytime he goes d5, well, I can sometimes take it, but I can also sometimes just play e5. Although then my bishop on b7 becomes a little, little sketchy, sketchy like. Let's just go rook c7. It's a useful, flexible move. I want to go knight f8 sometime soon, also. I think. I'm just gonna try to play quickly. Slowly outplay this guy. Of course, he has a lot of fear due to my high rating. So he'll just naturally assume all of my moves are brilliant, when in reality, they're probably not. Um, let's just go Knight of Fate. I like this game. I want to kind of keep the game closed up and gain as big of an edge in the clock as I can in the in the meantime. Maybe Queen A8. I don't even know what he's threatening here, so... I'll try to keep the tension. My Knight on F8 defends everything very well. Okay, he does. He goes for the opening of the position. Now, I think I'm gonna play e5 just because. Yeah, I don't want to deal with this crap. I could have taken it, but I didn't want to calculate that crap. Opening his bishop up just for a pawn. It just seemed. Well, actually, if I took, he would take on f6, and I would have had to take with a pawn, which would have been really unpleasant. Now that's a strengthy looking move right there. Um, maybe knight on six to d7. It looks alright to me. I have to be a little scared of like... I'm scared of knight of seven, but probably I don't need to be. I can just take it. Somehow, I'm scared of something. Something feels a little scary. <laughs> if pawn takes pawn, I take on g5. Should be okay. My queen on a8 is not like perfectly posted right now. Next move... Hmm, I'm pretty... God, I don't know. Let's say he goes knight f3. Do I take on f4? Or is that just too risky? Interesting. What if I play f5? I know it's crazy looking. But what if I just do it? He can go knight g3. But it does feel okay to me. Um, I think I might do it. It's just like such a committal move, but I'm going to do it. I hope I didn't miss, miss something. Knight g3, I was just going to go take this and then go like g6. And I feel like I have like a nice little situation happening here. I mean, he can maybe sack something on f5 someday. My knight on f8 looks pretty bad, but I'll untangle it somehow. He really wants to sack. So, let's think about this. I think I should go knight here so that I can defend with my rook along the 7th rank. He's going to sack, right? Otherwise, what is his plan? My pawns just look pretty good. Do I go knight a4? He has to go... One second. One second here. This is not a beautiful place for my knight. I'm going to be quite honest. But, 
I'm counting on the fact that my pawns in the center are good for now. Hopefully. Uh, I didn't see you guys in that move, which is not the hardest move to see. Maybe knight b8? And if c5, I, no, I have to be able to... h6? Any good? Or is it crazy? I'll just do it. <laughs> Take queen h4, it looks strong. Maybe he can, someday he can like sack, maybe. My, my pieces are like little offsides, but we'll see. We'll see what he does. I mean, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm ready to try to defend. I'm going to try my best if he goes for it. Like the clock situation, I'm good with the clock lately. That's one thing. You know, I've had a great streak and I've been playing well. It's because of my clock. I, oh, I'm never down on time lately. I just move fast and fast and fast. I have that rhythm now. It's here. It's he okay, here he goes. You knew the sack was going to come eventually. It's just a matter of time. Now, how do I defend myself? If pawn takes pawn, I'm kind of worried he'll go like queen h5. Well, I'm going to take it, whatever. I don't see, like, a mate, so I'm just hoping. Hoping and hoping. Um, King h7? Or, uh, I can, I mean, I don't know. If King h7, something seems sketchy. This also seems sketchy, though. So I don't know what the hell is going to happen. Knight g6, knight g5. Um, queen e... Made h7, rook f7. I can take it though. Well, this is really scary. <laughs> um, knight f7 looks annoying. Maybe I, no. I would have to go like queen e7. Someday c5 looks annoying. No, not yet though. It's gotta have a way to like annoy me here. Well, oh shoot, I just noticed queen h6 is check. Uh, only legal move, right? So I'll do it. Okay, that's strong. I'm gonna lose. I didn't see that. Let's see, it's forced mate. Oh, checkmate in one. Jeez, man. Yeah, you know, I knew the attack was gonna be scary. I, I kinda wanna see... I wonder if I know who this guy was. John Bryant. Sure. He's a great attacker. If I knew that, um, I wouldn't have let him attack me. <laughs> uh, you know, he's a real strong attacking player. Like, when, when the attack is on, he plays very well. I don't know, maybe my h6 was, like, not... Oh, it says bishop f5 just wins, so... Okay. You know, I always was scared of this attack. Every single time, it was just winning for him. Yeah, maybe the whole position, my king was just too loose, always. Hmm. And this e5 move, like, if I, if I take, he takes an f6. So, you know, the thing is, I never really want to go d5, because it blocks my... Oh, it doesn't block my bishop, though, when this is stupid thing is here. I forgot about that. Dummy. Yeah, in this type of position with a pawn in c4, you actually do want to play d5. Oh, I got a little mixed up, because usually you don't because it blocks your bishop. But now I can always relieve that, that I can give my bishop some space anytime I want. But yeah, I mean, this guy's a real strong player. Um, I just had... You just never want to let him attack you. <laughs> that's, the one, that's the one thing he's good at. Very, very good at. Uh, and so I guess that ends my... What, 21, 21 games in a row without a loss. I just ended it. And there we go. Oh well, it sucks to be me. I should have looked his. Up. I should have looked him up before the game. Honestly, I'd have been more careful, man. Cause you, I do like to play the player. Like I would just be extra cautious about letting him attack me, cause I know it's his specialty. What you gonna do? Anyway, can't win them all. Thanks, guys, for watching. See you next time. Bye, bye.